Georgia and today I'm going to be doing my August favorites. Whoa. Back back up. It's gonna be September. I have to go to school. What is this? I'm not happy about it. But I am happy that I get to show you all the things I've been loving this month. So let's just get started. So my first favorite is my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish and Soft and Gentle. I know it's a problem. You're going to see it in everything from now on. I'm wearing it right now. <laughs> my Sephora Fan Brush. So you just put some of that on. You put it on like this. And then you just apply it to the top of your cheekbones, down the bridge of your nose, and on your cupid mouth. It's a little no meter makeup tutorial challenge thing, I don't know. Okay, so I've been loving that, it's amazing. It makes your skin look so pretty and I want it, but I have it. What? Next is my Stila Convertible Color in Petunia. It's like beautiful, corally, pinky, beautiful, gorgeous pink and it's amazing and I love it. And I'm gonna swatch it right now. So this is like one swoopy. And it comes out kind of like it's just this gorgeous like corally pinky beautifulness and i apply it with my real technique stippling brush i do like boop and then i go boop and i'm wearing it right now <laughs> i'm wearing it right now and it's just so pretty can you see i'm obsessed with it go buy it okay next let's do my shuttle so first my mac paint pot it makes your eyeshadow stay on all day and it looks pretty like alone like you don't even have to wear eyeshadow like just wearing this alone is gorgeous and this was in soft ochre i don't know if i mentioned that and over that i like to put on my naked basics palette okay so this is like just the most gorgeous natural colors in the whole world and it's just so, so i'm gonna swatch the colors that i usually use so usually i put wos which i think is walk of shame on my lid the naked to on that crease which is like a pretty crease grayish brownish topish thing look you can just look and then i'll usually put like faint this dark brown in like the inners and it looks like that see, see? wos you can't really see because it's kind of skin tone uh naked too and faint sometimes i'll push the black like over my lashes like I did today. And I also put like Urban Decay 24-7 uh, Glide On Pencil in my tight line. I'm not actually wearing any eyeshadow today. I probably should have. And it's just so pretty and pigmented and I love it. And I wear it to school a lot. Next we'll do eyeliner. Jordana Fabu Liner. If you put this over a base, it looks a lot better than not putting it over a base. It's just pigmented. It applies really super easy. And I just love it so much. So forever and mascara obvi like my favorite combination ever i use it in my morning routine and i was wearing it during my uh, outfits of the week thingy and it's just the physician's formula organic wear 100 percent natural origin jumbo lash mascara in black organics that's my fault my covergirl club crusher and this is water resistant and they're both black they make your lashes voluminous long and not clumpy so it's just amazing together it's like natural okay um lips and i've got quite a few left four lip products <laughs> well first is just my eos lip balm i wear this like every day it moisturizes my lips really really well yeah. it's pretty it's not really pretty it's clear but it feels nice and then next we've got my mac that's right mac super fancy and nice and it's my mac cream sheen lipstick in cream cup like a pure Barbie pink. That's what the lipstick looks like, and that's what the swatch looks like. Can you see? It smells like vanilla. All MAC lipsticks smell like vanilla. So I almost just buy them to smell it. So it's just really pigmented and pretty. It's like the perfect just pink. Next is one of my many, many Revlon lip butters, and this one is in Tootsie Perfect. And these are a little more like moisturizing and less of like a stick. That's it built up. Like when you put it on your lips, it's way more opaque. 
and it's just so pretty. I wear it like every day to school. If you just dab it on, then blend it out, it's like gives you like the perfect flush of color. The last is my, and not, not least, probably my favorite, is my CoverGirl Smoochie, yay! Finally got my hands on one of these. This one is in hashtag sweet tweet. Just, oh, it smells so good. But you know those lip balms you buy when you're a kid that like the, have the princesses on it? It smells like that, like cherry. So pretty and sparkly and it gives you the perfect flush of color. So I love it and I wear it a lot. My favorite makeup remover, I had to share this because it's just so amazing, is the L'Oreal Eye Makeup Remover 100% Oil Free. Yeah, it's amazing. It removes makeup and it's totally not oily. Is my favorite part about it. It's actually out. So I bought the CVS brand because they were all out of the actual L'Oreal one and I was really sad. CVS one's okay too, but I like this one. So that's it for makeup. My favorite fragrance of the month has been Benefits Ring My Bella. So oh my god. It smells like sweet, but it has like really perfumey scent. It's just pretty, okay? And I like it. I'm gonna spray it on right now. So, that's my favorite. And I don't actually have that much perfume, so my favorite nail polishes. I've got what three nail polishes. The first one is just really boring. It's my Sesh V Sesh Clear. It's just a really good top coat, keeps it shiny, keeps it on, even though my nail polish is currently chipping away. So but it's actually a really good base coat. Like it doesn't stain my nails, which is good. So I like it. And then my first ever China Glaze nail polish. I'm, I'm speechless. It's in the shade Pool Party 872. It's just so pretty and neon and I love it. The last one is in Urban Outfitters nail polish. I know, surprise. And this one is in Buffon. It's like so true to color. What you see here is what you get. It's so opaque, it's so pretty, and I'm so in love with it. And I wear it every day, except for today. Now moving on to random favorites. So my first random favorite is gonna be a food favorite. <gasps> Can you just have like a moment of silence to appreciate how amazing seaweed is? Can I please just read the nutrition facts on here? Cause you'll blow your mind. 30 calories for this whole thing. Wait, oh no, half of this. Two grams of fat, no saturated fat, no trans fat. 50 milligrams of sodium, that's so good. One gram of protein and no sugar. And the ingredients are just seaweed, expeller pressed canola oil. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Sesame oil and sea salt. And it tastes exactly like sushi. I'm not even kidding. When you put this in your mouth, it's like eating a California roll. But I hate avocado, which is always in California rolls, but I just love everything else about them. So. Jolly Ranchers. Is it sad that I've eaten almost this entire bag by myself? My favorite flavor is grape and cherry. So good. And I'm obsessed with them. I'm obsessed with anything Jolly Rancher flavored, anything that tastes like a Jolly Rancher, anything that smells like a Jolly Rancher, anything that is a Jolly Rancher is going in my mouth. Skinny cow. Oh my god. But got this. There's only nine grams of sugar in like a bar of chocolate. And they call it a heavenly crisp. They are not wrong. This is the best thing ever. Uh, so good, like so good, so. Fashion slash kind of hair favorites. My first fashion favorite has been, not much else to say about that. There is, of course, my Lululemon headband. I wear this every night to sleep, because I have bangs, if you guys didn't even know that I have bangs. And when I go to sleep, I don't want this in my face. So I just put this on, slip them back, and it's perfect. And I wear it throughout the day too, like it's amazing. And then last one is my red leather bow. I got this at Forever 21. And it's just like one of those thingies. And it's just so cute when I do that little hair thingy like that. And then I put in the bow in the back. If you haven't watched my morning routine, go watch it. Because you'll see like half of this in action, okay? Oh yeah, it's amazing, I love it. My binder. So this is like so cool. Does anyone else think this is cool? Collaged it. I just cut out a ton of different words and pictures and patterns from magazines and I pasted them in. So I've got some like pretty little liars, got some Carly Red Jips. Me and my family, like my sister, my cousin, my mom, we all stayed up kind of late, like, not really late at all actually, but we basically collaged like six of these for school. And this is the Staples Better Binder, by the way, and it's actually like really good. I'm obsessed with my binder and I 
in a way and kind of looking forward to school, which is weird because I hate school. And so, yeah, it's amazing. I love it. And last is my favorite songs of the month. I've got three. My first favorite is Daylight by Moon 5. It's amazing, I love it. Next is Glad You Came by The Wanted. And my last favorite is we can't stop. Miley Cyrus is my girl. Wait, no, that's not my favorite. Stop it! Okay. No, I want to listen to the words. I don't know the words. Those are all my favorites for the month. I love them all. Oh, and my phone is my favorite too. Yeah, I hope you like, comment, and subscribe. Click on my face to subscribe. Have a really good day, okay? Watch me. I'm not watching you, don't worry. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Jama shorts are the way to rock it. <laughs> so just put that back and say it again. Okay, ready? Ready, set, and... Oh, I got seaweed right here. Don't record seaweed. Ready? <gasps> oh, it's totally noticeable. Oh my god, no it's not. <clears throat> Wait, I'm gonna get it. It's almost out. This is so disgusting. Okay. This is how I eat seaweed. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Can I have a piece? Uh -uh. My Shall we move on? And now I shut it off.